So have you noticed how online communities have just become increasingly divided and divisive? You know, I mean, 15, 20 years ago, it seemed like it was, you know, there was one group who thought that OJ got away with murder and the other group who thought that the state got away with trying to uh, frame him. And then it became, you know, the group who insisted that Black Lives Matter and the other in group who insisted that Blue Lives Matter, like somehow they didn't see that maybe everybody mattered. And there's this, uh, now we've got a group who, you know, insists very strongly that Donald Trump is a traitor and another group on the other side who insists that everybody who opposes Donald Trump is a traitor. And meanwhile, at least in the United States, we've got now literally hundreds, maybe thousands of TV channels that people can choose from, and um, none of them ever seem to show anything. There's, there's every interest that's imaginable, but none of them are worth watching. So I'm Dr. Stephen Brown. I'm the developer and founder of Adept Psychology. And Today, I want to talk a little bit about community. What is community and why is community important? And what we've seen with those examples, I mean, we we literally, I mean, Facebook, Google, uh, the cell phone companies, the cable companies, the insurance companies, they all have mountains of data on us. And so on the one hand, it's really good because you can go to Google and type in something and they know right away what you want. They'll, they'll help you find it very quickly. And so it's really convenient. But on the other hand, what it's done is it's increasingly separated us into these little communities that are very narrowly focused. Of, well, everybody needs this or everybody here agrees with that or whatever. However, it works on that platform and they separate us and divide us and they categorize us. And meanwhile, what's happening with the people that I know, that I work with, my clients, the members of my programs, is that they increasingly tell me that there's nobody for them to talk to. There's no group that really corresponds to what they want. They are interested in growing up in fulfilling their destiny and finding their vision in manifesting that into the world in bringing their power into creating something new and meaningful in life that's never been there before. But when you split between groups that think Donald Trump's a traitor or think everybody else is a traitor who's trying to get him, there's no place in there for those people. And there's no place in there for me. And maybe there's no place in there for you. And so if you're one of the people who tend to follow me, the kind of sensitive, spiritually minded person who really wants to get to the bottom of all of your own crap and just unload all of that and find your own inner vision and bring it forth into the world in all its glory. And there's no place for you. Then I've got a message for you because I'm building one. It's not built yet. It's not here yet. But for right now, if you're watching this on Facebook, if you Go up to the near the top of the screen, right under the banner that says Adept Psychology. You'll see a little blue button that says sign up. Hit that. What it'll do is it'll put you on my mailing list. Now, I'm not big on mailing lists. I've got a very small mailing list. I really don't bug my mailing list. It's one of the reasons I have such a small one because I don't really do much with them. I don't promote it. The only reason I want you to sign up is because I want to be able to have a conversation with you about you individually, what you need, and whether 
the community I'm setting up is going to be a good fit for you and how to make it a good fit for you if it is so that then once this thing is built, I can invite you. So I'm Dr. Stephen Brownlow, and I just want to say that community is important. So make sure the community that you belong to is one that really corresponds to you, to your values, to what brings your life meaning. And until next time, just remember, all the power is inside you.